St James's Park for this game between Newcastle women and Barnsley women. It's in the FA Cup second round. It's going to be a decent game. It's only the second time Newcastle have played here at St James's Park. The women, uh, there's a game last season against Anik Town. 22,000 were there that day. They've sold over 20,000 tickets for this one. It's going to be a decent game, so stay with us and let's see what happens. second currently in the National League Division 1 looking to get promotion uh, they've only lost twice this season did beat Barnsley 1-0 in the league at Kingston Park uh, a few weeks ago uh, they've only lost two games actually in the league this season so they're going to start this game slight favourites but Barnsley themselves uh, are sitting in fourth place just three points behind Newcastle with a game in hand they don't concede too many goals so I'm expecting this to be a really tight game it's a great experience for the girls to be playing here at St James's Park as well big pitch it's going to take a lot out of them especially if it goes to extra time I wouldn't be surprised if it does this could be quite a tight game it's Newcastle United women against Barnsley women FA Cup second round stay with us let's see how it goes
good goal as well it was, uh, number seven, edge of the box, knocked the past couple of players, fired in the top corner, really good goal. Newcastle's been a better team actually up until then, not really had too many chances as yet, but Barnes have used the ball well when they've had it, they look quite a good side, you can see why they've been so difficult to break down in the league. Um, but yeah, it's been, a, it's been a decent start to the game, Newcastle nil, Barnsley won, 15 minutes played.
to Barnsley 1. Just as we both predicted, actually, so that was quite good. Um, one nil at half time to Barnsley. They looked in control, actually, but then Newcastle got an equaliser about enough in midway through the second half. A great goal from distance into the top corner, and it transformed the team. A couple of substitutions seemed to make a difference, and then five minutes later, they took the lead. Another long range effort into the top corner. Um, three great goals in this game, actually, that has to be said. Um, yeah, the standard of football isn't up there with the WSL, we know that, but it was a good game. Uh, they gave everything, both teams actually, a uh, really committed performance. Um, and I say it was a decent game in the end, and Newcastle have gone through. Um, did they deserve it and over the night? Yeah, I think they did. Um, certainly second half, they were much, much better. Uh, they passed the ball better, they got the ball forward quicker. Um, and I say, two great goals. So, yeah, big crowd as well, 28,000. Really good to see everyone out to support the, the team. Newcastle women now are going to get more investment and they can grow and push on. I mean, credit to Barnsley as well. I thought they gave everything today and they maybe ran out of legs a little bit in the second half um, and Newcastle ran out on top. But yeah, it was a decent game of football in the end. Um, two teams, I say they both gave everything in front of a big crowd. Um, great memories for all those players today playing here at St James's Park. It has finished in the FA Cup second round. Newcastle United women two and Barnsley women one. It's a really good game and let's see who Newcastle gets in at the next round. Which is good, better. obviously. Would you come back again and watch them next time? I think I might. I think I might. I mean, you have to say it's good value, isn't it? It was oh, £3 a ticket e, for the that's game. nothing to um, mean. You know, played at the big stadium, great yeah, stadium, it was big crowd. Uh, yeah, was it over 28? 28,000, 28, yeah. That's so, really good. big crowd of Newcastle one, which was good. Yeah, um, definitely. Yeah, you know, everyone seemed to enjoy it, which was the main thing. Did, yeah. And lots of families, lots of kids out there. Yeah, and great. hopefully for the next round, yeah. um, See who they get. Home again, they get yeah. <laughs> yeah. So to get through that next round, they'll be in the fourth round when all the WSL teams come in, and who oh. knows? Maybe Newcastle might play Arsenal. That'd be fun, wouldn't it? Uh, mm. but, <laughs> but yeah, it was. It was yeah, it was. It was good. It was a good experience. Yeah. And, I say hopefully a lot of these people that's come today will want to come back again and watch more women's football. Definitely, yeah. definitely. Needs a lot of support, so that's good. Yeah, and it's finished. All for that. I say it finished 2 1 to Newcastle in the end. I say a decent, uh, decent win, a good second half. Um, and we move on. So if you have enjoyed this little vlog, please give it a like. Please subscribe like to subscribe. the channel. In the meantime, we will see you on the next one. Bye.